Good evening, I'm Michael Hertzenberg. Welcome to your Wednesday night KRQE.com webcast. We begin with Mark Ronchetti and the weather forecast. And we are going to see some changes, Michael. Sorry about that. What we're going to deal with here is the high pressure which has been over us is going to eventually flatten and move on out of here. Storm system drops in for early Friday over the four corners. That'll team up with a cold front across the northeast. The combination of these two will leave us with snow across the northern mountains by Friday afternoon and across the northeast Friday night and into Saturday. We could see accumulating snows as well here in the metro. Gusty winds on the way with a scattered snow shower or two. Police arrested an Albuquerque firefighter for drunk driving. Cops pulled over Michael Gutierrez last night. They say he failed to stop at a stop sign on Brentwood and Osuna Northeast. The sergeant said he could smell alcohol on Gutierrez's breath and he admitted to having one drink at a bar. He also failed several field sobriety tests. Gutierrez will be put on administrative duty at an animal welfare office while the investigation continues. A woman called 911 this morning, alerting Albuquerque police to what appears to be the city's latest homicide. The call came in at about 5 a.m. When police arrived at the home on 20th and Aspen near Old Town, they found a man's body inside. They say a man and a woman who were also inside the home are now being questioned but are not considered suspects. Police say the woman is the one who called 911 from a neighbor's house. So far, the victim has not been identified. Police will only say he's in his 40s. It's also unclear how he died. Join us for more news tonight on KRQE News 13 at 10.